what is up guys, it's Arodi out here, welcome to our Pokemon Victory Fire Nuzlocke Challenge, episode 22 I believe. In the last episode, we got lost quite a bit and ended up in the doorway of a cave that I have no idea where it leads to. So, if you guys are pumped for this episode, make sure you smash the like button down below as it does help support the channel and the series. Again, 10 likes on every single episode is what we gun for it, so let's see if we can do it now. Let's do a team party update. Nothing has changed. As you can see, we're still a bit injured with Kyra at the front. But, we have Kyra the Spiritual level 48, holding the leftovers with Shadow Ball, Faint Attack, Hypnosis, and Dream Eater. Sack is a Scrafty level 47, holding the Black Belt with Faint Attack, High Jump Kick, Focus Energy, and Crunch. Igneal the Charizard X level 48, holding the Charcoal with Flamethrower, Wing Attack, Fire Blast, and Dragon Claw. Olivia the Lapras level 48, holding the leftovers with Surf, Ice Beam, Rain Dance, and Confuse Ray. To Dome the Golem level 49, holding the leftovers as well with Earthquake Dig, Rock Blast, and Rock Smash. And none of the Meganium, who isn't really on the team, she's just here for cut purposes. And usually on this team, it'd be our Luxray, Raylene, that would be filling the spot. But either way, we're going to lead with Sags at the front. And I'm going to be completely honest with you guys, I haven't recorded... Uh, Victory Fire in like a solid two weeks. Exams have been crazy. So I have like absolutely no idea what we need to do. Because I just remember I was about to edit episode 21 yesterday. And I'm like, oh my goodness. I There's so many like bits and pieces. I'm like, oh wait. We did end up like screwing up the recording a bit here and there. We had to like cut because we got lost and everything. But the bridge is under repair. You better try another way to pass. So... I think we need Waterfall to get away. Give it away, give it away, give it away. Now we don't have Waterfall, we don't have Waterfall at all. Ha, it rhymed. Oh, there's a battle. I guess I didn't battle these people. I guess I went to like dodge them, but we have a Machop, which, you know, is quite threatening if it was like because of the resistances it has. But special defense, wow, I completely forgot about you being fighting and me weak to fighting. <laughs> Hit him on top. Let's go into... Well, we have nothing for fighting types, really. I mean, to be fair, we have Kyrie, but um, Kyrie is a bit injured at the moment. And I actually, why don't I heal Kyrie? That would be a better idea, just to be able to, you know, heal the Pokemon. But first off, before I do forget, let's go and switch Fan Attack with Crunch on the list, because that way Crunch is a lot better. So, items we have Soda Pop. Let's use that on Kyrie. I think I might have said, oh, I'll heal in between episodes. I might have, if I did, I apologize, because I didn't, oh, I didn't really remember. But, wait, wait, Sapphire Path, we already got, oh, I remember, we got you Jelly, the um, tentacle from Sapphire Path. So, I'm just going to be dodging everyone. Raylene would be perfect to have here, because you know how good a electric type would be? Tentacle, you're only level 7. What the hell? But where are we going to now? There's a a building. Bronze Port. This is a new area. If I can somehow, you know, get into it. I guess we need to go... How do we get into Bronze Port? This way? Oh. <laughs> For some reason I thought... Wait, wait. Oh, I thought it like overlapped. Over oh, there's a Reshi Ram. Um... That's a, that's a Reshi Ram. That is a definite 100% Reshi Ram. There's a big stage in the city. I'm just gonna. You, you can't see me. I'm hiding under Reshi Ram. I don't know. If, I might make that the thumbnail, but we used in episode 20 Reshi Ram. I don't know. Either way, I'll figure it out during post production. It's funny because ever since I started LPing, you always think of like little things like that as you go along. Like, ooh, what would be a good thumbnail for the. I mean, what would be a good screenshot for the thumbnail and things like that? And these guys are giving me nothing. What the hell is this? Launcher, uh, Luna Hotel, come here. We can make you feel at home. Okay, this looks like the contest hall from Emerald. Oh, yeah, it, it's pretty much just a carbon copy. Do they have the berry mixes? I'm talking to you through the back of the couch. TM41. Contains Torment. I only have a magic card with me. <laughs> So you can't teach it. Okay, well, Torment means you can't use the same moves twice, I believe. Something about your boyfriend and your girlfriend. You guys seem very happy together. Congratulations on your 
your beautiful relationship, I guess. Either way, let's continue on. I'm sorry, but only our guests are allowed here. Well, why aren't you letting me be a guest, huh? Why aren't you letting me be a guest? What if I have the Poke Dollar? Okay, do you give us anything? I want a Pikachu. My dad promised me to get one for me. It's really cute. Do I want a Pikachu? I'm going to buy one for a birthday. I have a Pikachu. Wait, 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 wait. What'd you say? I'm a bug catcher. But a professor called Elm gave me a water type Pokemon. I don't need it at all. That's a Totodile. Oh, wait. We, we have... <laughs> I just completely forgot. We have a Pokemon Center here. And we can pick up Raylene again. I was just speaking about that. Nala, you can go into the PC. And I'll leave Raylene in there just for a little bit longer. Just while I pick up this Totodile. And guys, apologies that I'm like going around the city a lot and exploring. But we, we you got to do that when something. Because look, we get free Pokemon. If you, if Totodile, if you were a, um, a Cyndaquil, I'd be so happy right now. I would have... Chucked him on the t Actually, I probably wouldn't have because Igneal is doing a quite good job. But, oh, I would have been so happy. Would have gone back all the way to the name Raiders even though, you know, I don't have Fly yet. Which, why don't we have Fly yet? Oh, my goodness. Um, there's a, a youngster here. Cannot go back home. Okay, well, that sucks. Collector. Okay, wait. My collectors have so many kinds of Pokemon here. I have an egg for you. That's it. <laughs> That's another thing I'm gonna go to the PC and deposit for. And in between episodes, I will hatch the egg. I, and hopefully, it is a good Pokemon. Last time, we ended up getting a Livia the Lapras from an egg. If it's, um... I don't know why, but I have a feeling like it's gonna be a fire type. Just... Actually, no, no, I have a feeling it's gonna be like a water type because we're surrounded by water. But to be fair, Lapras was water, so... I have no idea, but it came, came from Johto. If it's a Cyndaquil... If it's a Cyndaquil, oh my goodness, if it is a Cyndaquil, this egg is for Johto, I wonder what oh my god, wait, 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 this is gonna be a Cyndaquil, oh my goodness, okay, no, 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 no. I didn't want that, because, the if it's the Johto starters, which I'm guessing, we have, um, we have Totoro there, we have a Meganium, which used to be a Chikorita, and the only one left is a Cyndaquil, so, I don't know, a part of me really wants to just stop the episode and hatch it right now. But I'm not going to do that because I need to... Wait, something about biscuits? Okay. i got to get this video recorded, but I'm so pumped to, like, in between episodes, hatch that and then see what's going on. But either way, let's go into here. There's a Murkrow. Watch this. Please get back to the Pokeball. You say exactly the same as the, um, the other broken Murkrow with the broken Curlier as well, where... Curly just went blah, 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 everywhere. If you guys remember, like, episode, what was it, like, 13? I don't know. But there's a Pokeball here. It's a Protein or a Protein, if you want to go by, like, Greninja's ability. Attack stat boost. Let's go with, um... Let's go with Saggers. It won't have any effect. Okay, um... I guess we'll go with Dodome. It won't have any effect. I guess we're Raylene. I guess I will sell those. Um, unless it's just, like... Oh, okay, there we go. So the defense... Okay, wait. Rare candy, we have one of those Stardust can be sold. We have to sell a lot of items. Oh my goodness. Been waiting for my girlfriend, but where is she? I have no idea, buddy. Why is our reflection showing on this one little patch of sand? I I don't know. Oh, there's a Mirage thing going on there. I don't want to go see it. What's this? Bronze Port Fairy. Haha, ha, fairy funny. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I apologize guys, but you guys subscribed or if you're not, why don't you subscribe? But either way, let's just continue onwards. But like I'm saying, like you guys subscribed and you know what you got into when you click that, that button over there. What is this? Storeroom. Can we go in? Yeah, we... There's literally nothing. I feel like this is like a Team Mirage thing. There's a balding man here, which... Looks like every other ball. Oh, that scared me. I don't want to go there yet. I don't want to go there yet. There's uranium, and I think there's um pure. I don't know, but let's talk to you. Two years ago, Dr. Kathy, the gym leader of the city, closed the gym and disappeared. What happened to her? Actually, I'm not a local. I moved here when I was 10. You know, most of the settlers here are all from other regions. Well, it makes sense since this is like a... Hey, wait, what? A Ryolu! Okay, and why did we just 
pick up that Raiolu without even like needing to deposit something. I don't know, but Raiolu wouldn't be too bad if something happened to Saggers. Ooh. Raiolu, let's go summary. It's a naughty nature. Quick attack, bide, foresight, detect. We also have forearms. And how can I forget shiny? I completely forgot we had a shiny. Oh my goodness. Either way, I think that's enough dilly dallying around. Let's go and let's lead off with um Let's lead off with Let's lead off with Raylene since we haven't seen Raylene in quite a while. And I guess just in case it's a double battle, we'll lead off with Saggers. But let's see what's going on here. Nick, over here. What a surprise. I've never expected your coming. I don't know why you're always trying to stop us, but you really think what you're doing is right? What do you mean? What do you want to say? I don't want to answer you. I just want to stop you. Oh, well then. Oh, oh well then. What do you want to do? Just like this. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense, but... You mean a battle? Nick, if that's right, I'll accept your challenge, but I won't show any mercy this time. Okay, um... Don't have a Reshiram. Don't have a Reshiram. You have more... Oh my god, you have five... A Sigalith. Level 51! What? What? Oh my goodness! And that's your starting Pokemon! We are under-leveled as hell! Oh my god, I need to do some grinding! Absol! Okay, well... Say is you better not miss. I know I said we have replacements for you, but I really, really don't want you to, to die. Sag is, please. Every time the high jump kick happens, I get scared. If we can get level 52, if we can get um drain punch, that'd be so much better. We connect. I don't care what level you are. That is a dead absol. Goodbye, because you're as frail as a duck, as a wet paper duck. Sag is getting a bit of that experience. Spiritomb. Well, we have no thing to hit it with. We have our own spirit too, but that won't end well. Pretty much, you'll have faint attack. I guess we can go into the dome and earthquake, since you will most likely have only physical moves, and we are physically defensive. So spirit tomb is coming up. Look at look at him all happy. Oh, level fifty three. Fifty. I, I'm not gonna expect this to kill. Because Spiritomb is quite bulky. Yeah, as you can see, Torment. We can't use Earthquake, can we? Unless the Torment just takes effect now. Oh, okay. Okay, I didn't mean to click it again. Let's go Rock Blast. And hopefully we get enough hits to take it out. Please hit three times. Please hit three times. Oh, it only hits two times. Pain Split. What? Alright, let's go for an Earthquake. Hopefully we can take it out. Yes! Thank goodness. Uh, that was stretching it. That was really close. Um, Roserade. We're getting the hell up out of there. Let's go into Igneal. Our team just seems to be quite well-rounded at the moment. It's got typings for a lot of other typings. So Igneal, you should be able to take out this Roserade. I mean, we could go for a Wing Attack because you're more physical, but Flamethrower should definitely be able to take it out. Look at Roserade. Uh, it looks like a Matador or whatever it's called, like Zoro. I don't know if they're called Matadors, but yeah, looks really cool. One of the more interesting designs Pokemon has ever put out there. Okay, Zoroark. We have a Sagas. I was about to say, are you completely damaged? And sorry guys, I just want to check one thing. I just want to check how long we've been recording for, just so I know how long to make the episode and things like that. I guess we'll go for like another... 5-10 minutes, but either way, Zoroark, maybe a bit more, yeah, probably a bit more, but either way, Zoroark, you've got the Intimidate, you've traced Intimidate, but you don't Intimidate back, good job, High Jump Kick, Night Daze, that's going to do 52 or, no, 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 that, that's Night Shade, High Jump Kick, we missed, kept going and crashed, well, this is why we stock up on potions, okay, so, Soda Pop 60, 80, Let's go for 80, since that should be able... Okay, we... Yeah, that, that was perfect. Camouflage into a normal type. So you literally just made your weakness exactly the same. Taunt. Oh, no, now I can't set up my focus energy. Whatever will I do? Punch you in the face, mate. Or kick you in the face. I'll kick you with my fist. How about that? 
<laughs> and then again, we beat the Team Mirage leader, Wind. You're stronger than before. I've never thought about this. Wow, you gave us a lot of money. Oh my god. Uh, yes, my own Pokemon lost, but remember, Reshiram is with us now. You better not get in our way. All members, let's leave from here. Are you okay, Nick? You did great. You're really brave. Yes, I admit it, you're brave. But from now on, you better be more cautious. Anyway, do you know that Team Arise has been occupying the lighthouse? I don't know why they managed to do this. I just know they have to stop them. Hurry. I hope they don't have anything evil planned. I think it said plants. I don't know. I kind of clicked it too early. But let's go back and heal. And I guess we'll go to the Team Mirage area since we do have a bit more time in this episode and I don't want to end it prematurely. But if it does end up getting to the point where leveling is a factor and we are just narrowly escaping death. Okay, well, pretty much what I'm saying is... <laughs> while Uranium was interrupting me, if we're narrowly escaping death, then I guess we'll just stop the recording, do some grinding, and then come back in the next episode. But either way, Nick, hurry up, you slowpoke. The trainers we met before have already gotten into the lighthouse. I wonder if the trainers are okay now. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, exactly, that's my reaction. What the? Oh, young trainers, what are you doing here? Nick, wait, you ramp. See your end. You are hero of Unova. What are you coming for? Actually, I think I gave you the feminine voice or something, but... For a trainer called Nick. Nick's the one who destined to stop Reshiram. You mean me? Oh, you mean me? I meant that in my voice, but... Yes, this is you can see with my friend Nick. That's right, I was here for him. Nick, everybody in Tyron would like to depend on you. Why, why me? Why me? I'm just an ordinary trainer, but happens to be the protagonist of this story. Yes, yes, you may don't know, but Victinia's chosen you to... Be its partner to do it. But, but I even... No, it's, it's not as you thought. You, you're great enough to do this. Just try. Oh, um... Platinum N. Wow, okay. Are you gonna have... I'm guessing you're gonna have a Zoroark and then a um, Zekrom. Zekrom is Electric Dragon. Which, um... Which... Okay, what I'm thinking... Electric Dragon... So, if I go on my phone and Google up weaknesses, I'm pretty sure that we can go into, um... Ooh, that almost killed. Pretty sure we can go for a, um, Earthquake. But either way, let's go for a Zekrom. Zekrom and Reshiram. But even though I'm not going to Google Reshiram, because it's Reshiram. But either way, Zoroark was not really a big threat. Raylene actually has a, a surprisingly good amount of punch to it. And... Full weakness. Yeah, it is a Zekrom. It's... Is it weak? It is weak to ground, like I did think. For some reason, I thought Dragon might have resisted. But either way, Dodome can come on out. I could go into Igneal and Dragon Claw, but... 9 times out of 10, or odds are it's not going to kill. And if it doesn't kill, then, you know, we're, we're gonna die, pretty much. So, let's go for an Earthquake. We don't outspeed. Dragon Claw, we are defensive. So, we did tank that quite well. Earthquake, I'm not expecting this to kill. If it didn't kill a Spiritomb, it probably won't kill a Zekrom, even though it is super effective. Oh! <laughs> so close. Well, we can live another Dragon Claw, especially with the Leftovers help. It should help quite a bit. But Dragon Claw, as long as it doesn't crit, please don't crit now that I jinxed it. Okay, there we go. An N was taken care of. We really need to grind, like, to level 52 or something. Maybe maybe even 53, just, just because, you know... Grinding is going to take forever, and yada yada. Trainer N was defeated. <laughs> See, you can do this. Maybe I can. How about that? B but but I don't understand. W what, what? I can't do this. Potential, you know. You have such potential. You understand this. Potential? Yes. You were the chosen trainer. You're destined to stop pressure around, just as like I said before. Well, I should leave now. I have to go keep on traveling to get the truth of my life. Zekron, let's leave. Um. I. But you can help us beat Mirage, but either way. I, for some reason, I thought I said Zekrom Let Us Leaf instead of Let's Leave. But either way, if I remember, that's the title of this episode. Let Us Leaf. If I can remember, probably won't. But either way, we can really do this. I, I still suspect about this. But still, we have no choice. Let's do what we can do. Let's go, Nick. I'll be ahead of you. And you just sprinted the hell there. I guess we'll go, um, you know, toe poke uh, into the lighthouse a little bit. Hopefully, it's not like once you enter, you can never escape. Because that would be absolutely terrible terrible but let's lead off with Saga since he is the lowest level 
which is weird because he used to be like the the ace for the team. I'm not going to double battle this. I know we can double battle, but I'm not going to double battle that. Honchkrow, really the one time I put Sags in the front. Let's go to um, Raylene, actually. I was expecting a Pursuit halfway, but Agility. And you use your Agility to Air Cutter. I mean, to be fair, a Superpower would have been a little bit better if you, if you do carry it. Sucker Punch, maybe. But that's why you use the Agility. So, yeah, either way. Team Mirage. Mighty Yana. Okay. The Intimidate is on both sides, but it shouldn't matter because a high jump kick should be able to take him out. Yes, it does. Sag is... Oh, wait. I didn't even see the next Pokemon. It's a Houndoom. Faint Attack. Do less than half. Thank you. doesn't even do anything. And that is going to... Oh, my God, Sag is... This is why you have been on the team for so long. And speaking of that, we still have a few more minutes left. I'm sorry if it... You know what? I know you want me to double battle it, but you know what? I'm not going to double battle, because I don't follow your rules. <laughs> See, that is why you always pay attention to your surroundings, kids. Not because, you know, strangers can, like, do bad stuff, but because, you know, if you want to double battle the Pokemon in Nuzlocke, yada, 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 Spark, that's going to take out a Honchkrow. It is physical. We've been plus two'd, pretty much. Scrafty. Um, let's go into Igneal. Ignialga. Ignialga. <laughs> Wing attack. Scrafty, you... Took that quite well, actually. Special defense fell. Does not even matter. I had to fall to lose it all. But in the end, it doesn't even earthquake. One muck, he's gonna die. Doesn't even matter how hard he tries to survive. Uh, okay, okay, I, <laughs> I apologize. I just woke up, so I'm like, my, my head's in a bit of like weird places at the moment. But I'm like, you know what? Exams are pretty much over. Or, like, I'm halfway through, but I have a lot of study that I don't really need to do because I feel pretty confident with these next two exams. So I'm like, I'm going to record an episode for you guys. And Sleep Powder. Sleep Powder. Pedal Dance. We quad resist that, don't we? Okay. Okay. Can, can you stop? Can you can you wake up, please, Igneal? Igneal, I mean, I know, I know you're literally just being slapped with a feather telling you to... I mean, a leaf telling you to wake up. But you got to... You gotta thank you. I was about to say you got max sleep. If this was a more formidable opponent, I would have used like a, a um, a what's it called? Awakening. What I was about to say, it's not sleep heal or something. Let's go for a crunch since it should be able to take out a Wubat since Wubat is quite weak just by itself. Wubat is also a bit weak, but I guess we'll um have one more battle here, and then we'll like again toe poke, Scrafty um. Let's switch into Kyrie, because Kyrie seems to know what's up. Fan attack, it's neutral, and we have oh, good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Shadow Ball, Poison Stink. Don't poison. Thank you. Why don't you have Poison Jab? Why do you have Poison Sting? I don't know. It, it doesn't doesn't bother me either way. I mean, you 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 died. Sharpedo. Um. Water. I guess we're going to Saggers. But it's water dark, so I don't know. We we need to hit this. If it carries protect, then we're okay. Low it is. It's going for skull bash. Oh well, that one plus one defense doesn't help one of the thinnest Pokemon in the game. Was well, skinniest. I mean, like defense wise. But Sag is forty nine now. Let's lead off with Raylene. And what's in here? There's some more team uh, Mirage. I just said Makwa. I'm like, what the hell is Makwa doing, Raylene? The Intimidate... Oh, wait. He doesn't have Intimidate. He's got Runaway? Why would you have... Oh, no, no, no. You do have Intimidate. I thought I had Intimidate for some reason. What the hell? Persian. Um, Saggers, if you want to come out and show your stuff again, then feel free to with a, with a nice, beautiful high jump kick to the face. You can stop Fury Swiping anytime you want. Thank you. Why didn't you get for a Fake Out? I feel like you should have carried Fake Out. Raylene, back in action. Ready to take... Lives, let's go about. Look at him, he looks so happy. This sprite is so much better than the original Gen 1 sprite where his tongue's hanging out and you know he's doing his like little tongue thing. I don't know, it looks like Kiss pretty much. But either way, let's do this one last battle and then I guess we'll end the episode off. Faint attack, that's not going to do much. Let's say we resist it because we're dark typing, but we're not dark typing. This isn't a Dreyano hack. I should learn from my mistakes, but either way, scary face. Nah, I mean, we're alright. But go about again. Why am I... Why do I want to switch? I don't want to switch. Go about... That's going to, you know, take it out. I guess what I might do is go back on the, um... 
the water route up ahead and um, get a... Actually, before we end the episode, because we can actually technically get an encounter here, I think, if we fish. But we only have a good... Ro I, I don't know. We might. We'll try to get an encounter. And if we can't, then oh well. Because I don't want to get like an actual accidental encounter while I grind. If I do that, then I guess I'll just, you know, catch it with like a Pokeball or something like that. But over here, we can actually get a Pokemon. And key items, we have the good rod. So what are we going to catch? Come on. I'd be happy with like a Whalmer. I'd, I'd really enjoy a Whalmer. Because Whale Lord's actually quite under underused and everything like that. Not even a nibble. Not even one nibble. Okay, this is... Okay, oh, bye. Okay, good. I was about to say, okay, this is getting ridiculous. Bye. Pokemon's on the hook. What is it going to be? Our encounter. It's a Finneon. We already have a Finneon. So, you know what? Why don't we just go backwards and forwards here? It's a Basculin. A masculine bass. Basculin. Okay, well, Crunch, that's going to do nothing. Special Defense did fall. Doesn't matter at all. Hypnosis. Water... Okay, maybe it does matter. Basculin with Crunch is actually not too bad to have. I wouldn't mind using a Basculin since, um... You know, he's quite underused. Can you hit the Hypnosis, please? Name it Hypnosis. Or, like, Miss Nose. I, I don't know. Just, just take, please. Please, because I can't actually hit you for anything without killing you. Thank you. Actually, I guess we could probably go into Olivia and surf, but what Pokeballs do we have? We have a Ocean Floor. Okay, we have Netballs. Netballs. You work better on water types, you were caught straight away. You're a Masculine Bass, um, Strong Fish, Swordfish, Zorro. We're going to name you Zorro because we are talking about Zorro before, and it's like Swordfish. And I know he's not a Swordfish, but like he's also a Fish. I don't know, it makes sense in my mind. But either way, that's going to end today's episode. If you guys did enjoy, again, 10 likes is the goal. So make sure you leave a like, favorite, comment, subscribe on this video. Do all that good stuff. It really helps me out. Uh, follow my Twitter if you haven't. Link will be in the description below. Before we take on more Team Mirage stuff in the next episode, we're going to have a lot of grinding. And I'm going to hash that egg so we can get stuff done. But yeah, don't really have much else to say. This has been a Rodiad. Catch you guys later. Peace.